All right, oh, this is WWJ whipping with Joe. Uh, this is the 13th hour on the Kabu 50. Still working good. Using our coolie lure. Well, I was totally wet today. I got drenched. Anyway, we got 50 pound braid in here. So I'm going to show you how I maintain them. I'm going to maintain this Kabu is the same as I did the Spheros. So basically what we do is we do three times. You go two, three with a spray gun. Spray over here. And the lure and the eyes of the 610 HMX, my favorite rod or HMG. Okay, so this is it. This is how we're going to maintain the Kabu, which is the same way I uh, uh, maintain the. Uh, the Spheros and all the other reels. Spheros the only one would, 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 would handle this portion. Um, and that's about it. So, I love this portion here. We can put the lure in there, so that helps. Uh, but because you don't want to put it over here, basically, you don't want to bend the bail. And you don't want to put them a high guide. So I put it over here. It's pretty interesting. It does work though. Anyway, again, this is my 13th hour, WWJ, whipping with Joe. About an hour, a little over an hour, and uh, no wind nuts. Yuk, yuk. So, to make the problem was the shim. Take out the spool and there's an extra shim in it, take them out and that, that solved the problem. Uh, you can use the automatic bail and the man, it doesn't matter, automatic still didn't give me the wind nuts today. So a little over an hour. So okay. Uh, again, this is WWJ with the Quantum Cabo 5.0. A likely contender to the Spheros at 355 cranking hours. Woo woo! Advantage of this one here versus the Spheros. It's got a higher drag. It's got uh, 35 pounds of drag compared to the 22. The drag system is more adjustable uh, because of high drag too. You can go high drag and you can go low drag. You can go small big game fish. Um, it's, uh, it's more affordable than the Sparrows actually. So this cost me 165 on the web. Uh, the Sparrows is a little higher than that. Um, I like the looks of it uh, compared to the Sparrows. It's, it's better looking. And um, and I love the drag. It, it makes, makes a loud clicker. So that's three things. Um, the only uh, thing I, I, I see is that uh, it's not as smooth as the Sparrows. This is not as smooth as the Sparrows, that's for sure. Uh, but that's okay, as long as it cranks on smooth and not hard to crank and all that kind of stuff, uh, it'll be good to go. But we'll see. Again, WWJ maintaining the Cabo 5-0. Hello.